he's amazing. He's literally what all the memes say about him. Like he is the coolest dude in the world. Dira. Hola, que hermoso tu backdrop. <laughs> there you go, Lexi from the Matrix Resurrections. Well, congratulations. What a cool role to have. You play one of the crew um, in this new Matrix Resurrections. What was it like? Well, obviously you work with um, Lana Wachowski on Sense8. So yeah. you already had kind of a connection there. So you were like, hey, come on. <laughs> Yeah, it was kind of coming home for me. I think that's what it felt like for a lot of us, especially like the senses that are now on this, uh, Toby on Memoria, Brian J. Smith, um, Max Rymelt, like, and a whole bunch of other little surprises. Once you watch it, if you're a sensi, you're gonna just love it because it's full of little like winks to to sensate. But it was it was that it was coming home to work with our family again on something that defined us as people that gave us a reason to believe in uh, that the change in the world that we want to see is just about you know us working for it and changing our reality and it was like it was it was a very exciting experience a, a reunion of both families a bit of a a marriage between the matrix and the and sensate families and what was it like for you i mean obviously you can see in the background here as lexi you're super cool you got the braids did they actually make the braids in your hair because they look really like tight like yeah. in the both sense of the words <laughs> yeah <laughs> thank you um, yeah, it was a very uh, intense hairstyle. It took about six hours to do. I would live in it basically because a uh, six hour pre-call isn't what a production would think is good. So I, it would take about 10, 15 days before I would switch my hair. Um, but it was kind of beautiful. We, we really wanted the avatars that we have within the matrix to reflect the, the readiness for war and what we want to see. So I think she's very strong and very powerful and, and it's exactly what she needed to, to go out there and kick butt. Well, you gotta suffer for your art, right? Exactly, <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> and of course, everyone's asking, you have a really cool scene with Keanu Reeves and you get to interact with him a lot. So what was that like? He's amazing. He's literally what all the memes say about him. Like he is the coolest dude in the world and he's just humble and loving and uh, very passionate about what he does. He's very much a perfectionist. I still know Kung Fu. And that's very appreciated, especially like on a set where with Lana, we've created this like sacred space where we work and we just, we have to be ready for everything. And, and it's about just being ready for a leap of faith with her into whatever she wants us to do. We'll do you want to fly, then we'll fly. Like, that's just how it is. <laughs> and, and Keanu was very much of that team. And that was something that, you know, you could have thought being one of the most famous men in the world, he would be a little bit more uptight about staying on set all day instead of going to relax in his uh, RV and stuff. But Lana has us on set. That's just how we work. We're, we're never relaxing. We're always ready to work. And he was there first, like, you know, right foot forward and with a heart on his sleeve and just with a big smile. And, and it was a beautiful opportunity to get to know him as a person and to get to know um, Carrie Ann Moss, who I admire profoundly also. And, and just to know that, you know, these people, yeah, they're super duper duper famous, but they're also super duper 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 cool.